Hi, I'm Kashish. I'm an RA in Peterson, and this is my dorm. Come on in. And I'm a human physiology student on the pre-medicine track. I work as an RA in Peterson Hall, and um, typically in my day, I go to classes for till about 4.30 in the evening, and then I come back to my dorm and finish up some RA tasks, and then I um, go to the hospital to volunteer. Usually in my free time, I go out to coffee shops or just walk around and hang out with my friends. And um, something else I like to do is sit in this corner of my dorm and read all my books. Currently, I'm reading The Alchemist, um, which is my favorite book so far. It just helps me relax and um, you know sleep with a fresh mind. So I have a class starting soon, so we can head there now. That was the first class of my day, which was organic chemistry, and that is one of the few courses that I take as a human physiology major. And it is really helpful to take that class because it also helps building a good foundation for um, my later pre-med courses, such as biochemistry and other extensive chemistry classes. The professors in the classes are really helpful as they provide a lot of flexibility with homework and support outside of class, such as in office hours. And then the university also has a lot of academic resources, such as CSI sessions or other tutoring sessions that provide additional support for the classes you're taking. Hi, I'm Ned Bowden. I'm a professor of chemistry. I started here in 2002, so this is finishing my 21st year. Currently, I'm teaching sophomore organic to about 400 students, and so I'm very interested in seeing them succeed. Uh, outside of that, I also run a research group. We're studying agriculture, membranes, and polymer. I hold office hours. Uh, I meet with students outside of my office hours. We also, in the course, we have uh, supplemental instruction. We have graduate student TAs who run discussion sections. Uh, we also have uh, a chem center where you can go and seek more help. We have a, a room that's staffed uh, 9 to 5, Monday through Friday, with graduate students in there. So if you have any problems, you can just go in there. We also have an American Chemical Society undergraduate uh, section. They run review sessions for the classes, so you can join that and meet with other chemistry majors. There's plenty of opportunities for uh, working at the hospital. A lot of opportunities with the uh, dental school. We really want students to do well in this course. It's a challenging course, but we want students to be able to take this course, succeed so they can move on to the next level. So we do everything we can to give you that option. And so now, um, after my class, I head back to my dorm to get some RA work done. So I usually come here to check my mailbox and uh, um, to see if I have anything to put up on my bulletin board. And I live on the 10th floor, so it's kind of a long way up. Let's go. So as an RA, one of the tasks we perform is um, completing Hawk Talks with each of the residents. And um, they're just one-on-one -on -one check ins with all of the residents to see how they're doing in their classes and if they need any additional support from us. And another thing we do is put up bulletin boards like the one you see behind me um, and they're just uh, little resources that um, the residents can use and they're given to us from our academic partners on campus and uh, yeah after this I usually go volunteer at the hospital so let's go get ready for that. Outside of academics and courses the university has a lot of resources to help students gain experience for their future careers one such way is by volunteering at the hospital. Um, I usually volunteer at the hospital three hours a week and um, in my role as a volunteer I usually stock blankets and help patients in whatever they need and I love volunteering because it helps me gain exposure to the medical field and I get to talk to so many great individuals who work at the hospital. Um, but yeah, that's usually what I do for the rest of my nights. If you're planning on going to Iowa, I would say that it's a great campus and there's a lot of people and a lot of opportunities here. Um, there's definitely something for everyone and everything. So um, just be open to trying out new things and meeting new people. I think that's the best way to enjoy college. Um, and yeah, I hope to see you on campus next year.